Tonight, only on two. They're behind bars charged with serious crimes. The time can be difficult for children, but a jailhouse game is helping some of those family relationships. Here's CBS 2's Dana Kozlov. Inside the concrete walls of Division 11 at the Cook County Jail, behind secured doors, there's a monthly game of strategy that connects detainees with their children on the outside. Hey, daughter. How you doing? It's virtual chess. Dads are in the jail's library. They're kids at Chicago's Mount Carmel High School. It keep us going. You know, from the distance away. LeVar Haywood is awaiting trial on a felony gun charge. He plays chess with all three of his kids who try to make the trip every month. Cause my wife, she don't want to bring them up here face to face with me and it's like make it the chess game, make it. We interactive, you know, more than we was outside. I guess this brings us closer. I guess you could say that it's, this is brought us closer. How so do you think? Um, we talk a lot more. Um, we laugh a lot more. Cook County Sheriff Tom Dart says that connectivity I miss you. is the point. They're now in a position where they are like instructors to their children, and in some cases they have never had that role before, and it just changes dynamics. In Raymond Anderson's case, it's given him a relationship with his daughter. Now, as I, again, we can't know our feelings and talking to her, having that line of communication, she tells me, Dad, I was hurt, Dad, I was sad. I never knew that. Hit the X on the play button. Sheriff Dart's 17-year-old son, Tommy, is the brainchild behind the program, the only one in the country. We're going to be obviously looking at sort of the hard data part of it, too, like, you know, recidivism rates and things like that, but that'll be all down the road a little bit. But logistics can be difficult. In Anderson's case, his daughter, expected to show up, never made it. Now mm -hmm. he'll have to wait another month yeah. to match wits with his 12-year-old again. Why is that important to you? Because <clears throat> I never had no one in my life. I never had no one in my life. Even though they was there in the house, but they wasn't paying attention to me. Like I wasn't paying attention to my daughter. Now I'm paying attention to her. And now I am able to talk to her and have that father and daughter relationship. I wasn't able to discuss the specific charges against them with the detainees because their cases are pending trial, but I did ask them if this family chess game in any way made them think about the choices they'd like to make if or when they get out of jail. And they all told me yes for their children. Live outside Cook County Jail, Dana Kozlov, mm -hmm. CBS 2 News. Robin Erica. What a unique way to connect. Unbelievable. Yes, and taking the initiative coming from a 17-year-old yeah. to come up with this, Dana. Absolutely. Pretty <laughs> impressive.